This is uh, something new. It's entitled Wishes. New shit. New shit. New shit. New shit. <laughs> Is a dream-filled leap into the sky the same as drowning? They are both blue and appear so clean, the earth's polluted sky and trash-filled oceans. Every day we live as if we're dreaming, smoking to get high, making sure we never come down and face ourselves. Otherwise, how would we ever get by? Running on this racetrack day after day just to survive, convincing ourselves we'll make just a little bit of difference in someone else's life? Only existing till the end of the night. Smoking weed for the chill, popping mollies for the thrills, drinking as if humans were really meant to have gills. Clinging to people who just don't care. And we know they didn't give a fuck because I look around and they are no longer here. All this just to ensure we won't end up alone. Drowning in a sea of others with no one to call our own. To make sure we won't die absolutely surrounded, even in the grave. Sealed in that cold coffin, six feet under, just you and your regrets feasting away like the maggots on your pathetic, lonely soul. <laughs> Sometimes I think wishing and dreaming both motivate and suffocate me. And I'm convinced the world can hear the melancholy symphony of throbbing between my legs, or even the darkest secrets I keep locked inside my head. Every 11-11, I wish for success. I wish for higher stakes like swimming with sharks, causing myself just more and more stress. But the longer I chase these dreams of happiness, I find it harder to see the ground. When I fall, who will catch me? When I'm dead and my name is said, will it really make a sound? I mean, will anyone hear it? I think wishes are dangerous and I know love hurts. But it hurts so good and I want it so bad, I'm just willing to bear it. So I tat a sword on my arm, and to let the world know I'm tough, a broken crossbone heart on my wrist, right, right underneath I've scribbled, show no love. Wouldn't it be so nice to just for once in our lonely little lives, shine bright like an impenetrable diamond, to survive the venom of love and not die slowly inside from its poison, walk on fire and be masters of our own lives, on top of the earth for just that one night. But the reality is, a leap of faith with your eyes closed can lead to a fall, dreams shattered and your weakness exposed. And once you've come down and hit that ground and no one else has noticed because you didn't even make a sound, you'll be alone and you will positively drown. Thank you. Wow. Hey, hey.